Howdy folks, this is what I got going today. I've been over at the uh, Pathfinder School for the last several days and uh, getting ready to go back for a basic class. So I haven't had a lot of time for videos. Uh, so I got a couple of new pieces of gear in. Uh, I'm going to show you that. I'm going to be trying it over the next couple of weeks. And uh, I don't really think much of unboxing videos because all that really tells you is I know how to open a box and look at my mail. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to show it to you. I'm going to try it out for a couple of weeks, and then I'll come back with another video letting you know whether it's uh, something I like or not. Let me change the camera around. Okay. What we've got first today is the uh, Pathfinder Campfire Survival Cook Set. Uh, this is based on the can on the uh, stainless steel canteen that Pathfinder makes and uh, I'm not going to get a lot into the gear because uh, we all know the Pathfinder stainless steel is high quality stuff and uh, I've already got a couple of these canteens. Uh, I like this bag already. Uh, it's got a lot of nice attachment points. Got loops I can attach other stuff to. It's got a nice big pocket in the front. Yeah, I'm digging that already. And another pocket here in the front. Uh, it's got the standard Pathfinder stainless steel canteen. Wide mouth, which we really like a lot. And it's got... The cup. Handle locks, just like your normal GI. We'll do a full review on this after I've, after I've played with it for a couple of weeks. I've already have played with one of these, so it's not going to be anything new for that particular part. Uh, came with the twig stove. You can also put your uh, alcohol burner under there. Uh, lid for the cup. And some little auxiliary parts here. Fish mouth spreader to help you pull it out of the fire. A uh, small ferro rod. And a can of mini infernos. Alright, that's what comes with the kit. Uh, you saw it all packs down in this bag really, really well. I really like this bag. So that may be my everyday bag, even if I don't stick with the... Uh, the other stuff that's in the kit. And uh, I've also got one of the new Pathfinder logoed Victorinox sacks. Got a lot of good blades on it. Corkscrew, I guess, in case I want to do some lining. You can also bore some holes with that. What else do we have? Large blade, screwdriver and bottle opener, another screwdriver and bottle opener, small blade, scissors, I get my finger in there, be all right. An awl. And a package hook. And of course it has a toothpick. And a set of tweezers. And that's really all we've got going on here. It's got a nice logo on it. This is a Victorinox, so it's a actually good quality blade. So... That's what we've got right now, and this is what I'm going to be playing with for the next couple of weeks. And uh, I'll be back with another video after I played with it for a little while. Uh, truth is, is I'm really busy. I'm going back for another class here pretty soon, so I'll be using this as the class as my primary water bottle and so on and so forth, and we'll use that. And uh, before you tell me I'm sitting in poison ivy, I know I don't get poison ivy. Talk to y'all later.
All right, that's it for today's video. Uh, if you want to check out the products that I uh, kind of uh, recommend on SRO's website. You can click in the links in the description for my for my suggested gear, and uh, you can get to any gear on the website from that. Uh, let's see, there are other links down there if you're interested in those. If you want to support the channel, uh, that's really all I've got for today. So thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for your views and thanks for your support. Uh, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell and. Uh, Check out my buddies over on the sidebar from the main channel page. And that's it. See you all in the woods. Bye.